two of my series, How to Be a Badass. Today, we're going to go over how to look like a badass. Now, first impressions are always important, especially when it comes to being a badass. You want a wardrobe that says, hey, don't mess with that guy. You want some clothes that say, that's the last guy you want to be messing around with. So, we'll start with my shirt. Now, as you can see, I am wearing my fancy as going out clothes. But these, this shirt, would not play too well in New York City with the street punks. They'll take one look at it and say, hey, look at that chump from Hodok. Let's go get him. So, we're going to ditch the shirt. Now, as far as what I'm going to go with, you're going to go with a sleeveless tank top. Or as the kids like to call it, a spousal abuser. As you can see, it allows me to show off my muscles, flex them. I got in. It says, hey, I'm ready to throw down. Now, seeing how I ditched the shirt, I'm going to ditch the hat next. Place the fedora, the baseball cap. Turn sideways. Badass style. Now, another important thing about being a badass is fancy jewelry. This says to them, hey, I'm a street pirate. And these, this is the booty I've collected. So, you're going to put on some flashy jewelry, or as the kids like to call it, bling bling. Moving on, pants. You can see I've gone with a nice pair of camouflage pants. This sends out the message that I'm a soldier, or as they like to say it, soldier. Now, question with the pants. What kind of belt do you want to go with? The answer is no belt at all. Then take that off, and let those pants slap down. The reason for this, for this is badasses, they're not afraid to show their shortcomings, shall we say. And some of you might like say, well, are you running your pants are slapped down? You're going to fall. That's the thing. Badasses, they don't run away. Also, you want to hike up your underwear. Now, I don't understand this myself, why you do this, but hey, that's what they do in the street. Moving on, sunglasses. This shows you're not afraid of anything to wear, like wearing your sunglasses at night. And this way, they can't always look you in the eye. Now, another important thing about being a badass is having some ink or tattoos. Now, I'm not saying you should go out and tattoo yourself up just to look tough. You can fake it, and that's what we're going to do today. So, first tap, I'm going to go with brownie face. Shows I'm always upset with the world. Yeah. Another one, I'm going to go with Hangman. That shows that I'm an executioner. And Thug, well, that's that thing. Check out my next video. I'll have more ink, so you'll see what my tats look like. Based on what's the next video coming up, it's going to be the walk and talk of how to be a badass. Check it out.